Hey, welcome back, Ali here, and in this video, I wanna talk about a very simple tactic that you can use to stand out and also increase your engagement uh, on Facebook for your Facebook business page. It's very simple, and it's the use of different fonts and styles and also making your text bold. So for example, look at this, uh, such a simple example. Uh, this post right here, so look at this line, is actually bold, right? So this text is different and it stands out in the newsfeed and you can easily do this you don't have to use any paid tools i'll show you in a second uh, look at this so this is the we're running a black friday it's a sale campaign and you can actually make the whole text or change the style of the whole text or in this example i just changed the the style of the the first line so it kind of catches attention when it's people are scrolling through their Facebook newsfeed and they're likely to read more and that creates more engagement for your Facebook posts and also the business page. And I, if you have the budget, you can boost or use this type of, uh, these type of styles in your ads too, which will actually increase even your engagement to another level, take it to another level. Now, how do you do this? Uh, let's actually look at the process. And we're gonna use a free tool, a free website. And actually, I think in your, uh, app store on your phone if you search for like font styles you can probably find like tons and tons of apps but the one i use is, is called yay text and i've talked about this before it's completely free yay text you can right like right now i'm using on desktop you can also open this on your mobile phone and play with this so for example let's uh, bring that text right here so here's the the complete text and you see if i if you scroll down it's, it looks kind of funny because I had already had some emojis uh, and stuff like that. So I'm, what I'm going to do is just let's remove all of this and keep the the first line. So black November sale. Look at that. And then if you look right here, so you see how different styles of text. And I believe I probably used this one right here. That's it. So let's actually go back and start creating a post. So Let's say I'm creating a brand new post, copy that. So I already have this bold. So let's actually make this line change the style of the second line. So I'm gonna go back and now look at this. So here are all kinds of styles. I know some are like hard to read. So that's another thing. Make sure you do you change the style. It's all good, but make sure you pick something that's readable for people, right? you do not wanna make it difficult for them to read. So for example, I actually like uh, this one right here. So I'm gonna go with this one, it's bold. And let's copy this, so let's go back. And I am just gonna replace this. And obviously I can make the whole uh, text bold or change the style. Or you can do like me by changing the first line, the style of the first line, so it captures attention, and the rest of the text you can keep it the default. But this is how, by using a free tool like Yay Text, you can change the the text style of your post on Facebook and capture more attention, more engagement in the news feed. And if you have the budget, absolutely boost this post or create an ad to even like reach bigger audience. So that was the the, the main thing I wanted to talk about in this video. I want to share one other bonus tactic so when you are creating content on your facebook page don't be afraid to create content or post content which is informational but relevant to your audience and i i call this like memes but on brand so for example this page the audience of this page is this page is about selling electronics and appliances so the audience is moms or uh, you know, people who are like buying new houses and they wanna uh, upgrade their kitchen appliances or electronics. So for example, look at this. So this is a meme we used and it's a meme. So you, know, you can say we're not selling anything correct, but it's an on-brand meme, meaning it speaks to our audience. So people who uh, you know, wanna in improve their kitchen appliances, they also struggle with sometimes messy stuff in their kitchen, right? So it speaks and it posts like this create crazy amount of engagement. Let's see if I can find, here's another one. So again, it's not promotional content, but it's the relevant content that speaks to our audience. It could be a meme, it could be other type of educational content. See, it speaks to the moms or people who are cleaning their kitchen 
uh, in a very, very fun and interesting way. Here's another one right here, cleaning with kids, like that. So it's speaking to the mom, it's speaking to our audience in a fun and entertaining way, but it's not our promotional content. So whenever I create a content strategy for any page, any business on Facebook, I try to mix it up. So maybe you wanna do 80-20, so 80% of the value, informational, fun content, and 20% of the promotional content. And obviously, if you have different campaigns running right, right now, we're going through our uh, Black Friday deals, so we are promoting heavily, but you can you know balance it like that. When we're not in the campaign mode or campaign phase, we post less promotional content. So that was the bonus tip. But again, going back to, you can use different style of text to stand out and increase your engagement. And then bonus tip in this video was, think of memes, but on brand memes. Memes that sp speak directly to your audience. That content can also increase your engagement.